My name is Michelle, I'm the manager here at the Rivalta Cultural Center and I'm with you today to talk about our pillar of community and what that means here at Rivalta. What are we doing um, to bring that sense of community? The amazing and lovely thing about this space is that you can come in at any time and find people coming together. People coming together from all walks of life. If you come to the parenting circle for moms, you have moms ranging from mothers of babies to mothers of full-grown adults, finding a place to connect and a place to really share trials and how to overcome those trials and tips and tricks for this road of motherhood. And you can come in another time and come to the ladies social and find a completely different crowd who is just looking for a place that they can just let loose with their fellow Muslim sisters, that they can come together in a safe space and enjoy that time together, whether it's crafting or cooking or potlucks. It gives them a space that they can come and just freely be themselves and not have to explain who they are to anyone. Another segment under our umbrella of community is our chapters. So while we have this space here in Rabata Cultural Center, we do have people all over the globe as part of Rabata that have formed communities creating that safe space where they are. So we do have chapters all over the United States and then outside of the United States we have affiliates. And so we have friends that you can go uh, anywhere and really just be able to connect to someone and feel safe. Another part of being part of this community is our amazing uh, robotiers or our volunteers. They are really striving to give back to the community and they're just looking for that space to do so. Quite a few of the programs that we have here at the Rabata Cultural Center were started because a volunteer said, you know what, I really would love that we have a book club at Rabata Cultural Center. We want a place to talk as Muslim women about these books. The Parenting Circle for Moms was started by a volunteer. We have story time every month that a mother was like, this would be really awesome. So this community um, that we've established here at Rabata has really been a an experience that is really growing. One of our other segments under community is our convert care. And knowing that converts feel safe here, that they can find uh, material that helps to support their journey, uh, whether it's uh, new prayer clothes as they're you know, working their way through the unfamiliar Arabic sounds, or it's just a friend to make wudu with, they feel comfortable here and they're able to do that. And that is a part of community, knowing that you have a safe space to be. Each and every event we do is, community is a big part of that. You know, um, being able to find someone to connect with in a world where oftentimes you feel isolated. When you come here, our hopes are that you feel part of something a little bit bigger, that you feel connected and you're able to really contribute. This community definitely, you know, you feel it here at the headquarters in Minnesota, but the ripples go all across the world. <laughs>